Hey there guys, this is Charms Way and welcome back to Cognition, the Oracle. In the last episode, uh, we got in the building and our boss is getting told off by somebody else. So it's going fucking great. Okay, let's uh, go look around. Honestly, this is like, okay, I haven't been having the best of luck with recording. This is the second time I'm recording this one because I blue screened while doing it and with Sam and Max I blue screened again this was last night then when I tried Sam and Max again today the whole time I was previewing not recording so I am slightly mad but I had some uh, lime pie key lime pie stuff like that holy I totally forgot I had this in my pocket shite I'll put that up there so let's see if this will be any better empty it looks ornamental maybe it's one of those singing bowls singing bowls question like mark question mark bird that that's it that's all okay that, that's cool okay it's just a branch, but there's something about it I don't like. Something kind of sinister. It's a brand. All right, let's go into the garden area now. This is it. The same balcony I saw in that vision. The killer had Joey up here. Oh, God. Uh... That's a long way to fall. Oh my god. Oh, bloomy sake, that's too high. It's too high. It's too high. It's not nice. Why you do that? Oh, blimey sake. Okay, touch it. Pretty sure yeah, that's John's. I'm going through here. This is just ridiculous. I'm not wasting my time. I'm telling you. Yeah, what do you want? I am looking. Scouring this place. There's nothing here to find. Yeah, I know Jeff Therian. Well, I haven't found a damn thing in this place on Jeff Therian. Are you sure it's not a bogus lead? All right, fine. I'll keep looking. Gah! Good God. Too old for this shit. He was just up here. Did someone get to him? No, he's not. I'm not losing anyone else. Oh, God. This lighter is coming with me. You know, go give it back to him. He's gonna be fine. He's gonna be fine. I don't okay. know what it is. Okay, I don't do plants. That's lovely. This must have been where that black flower came from. Yep, there's the cut stem. Why would you? Okay. There's blood on the table. It's coming from under the flower pot. Okay, so move the flower pot. There's blood under this. So it was set here after. Oh my god. <laughs> Please. Please. What? I, I have to do it? What the? Okay. I don't like this. Did you kill the your fuck? brother, Miss Smith? What? Yes. Yes, I did. What? I was right about you. Clever and persistent. I knew you'd make it here. I've been waiting for you to show up. Years. And here you are. Just like the visions show. We're more connected than you think. And if you're a better investigator than some of your co-workers, you may find out how far that connection goes. God damn it, Cordelia. It's fucking you. Maybe you can still fucking save it. John, but it's too late for Joey here. He knows what's coming to him and why. Right, Joey? No! Oh, oh God. What's happening to me? Uh, I can't make the vision stop. I need to get out of this now. 
Do it, do it, do it. Get out, get out. This is not. No, I don't want to. Oh, God. Please, I Erica. Fucking knew it. Don't disappoint me. It was like she was controlling it. She was talking to me. Cordelia. I need to call Rose. Uh, we might want to get evidence first. Let's grab it first. <sighs> There's the last bit of evidence from the wise monkey killings. God help me if it's anything else. I'll put it with the one I already have. Oh my god. What the fuck? Okay. So, I guess I have to call... Sorry, I've gone... Like I said, I went through this. And then shit happened. But... Rose has been a huge help. I'm glad I was wrong about her. Well, call her. Supposed to call her. There we go. Here we go. Hello? Rose, it's Erica Reed. Something really weird just happened to me. Erica, my dear, just calm down and tell me all about it. I had a vision, but I was stuck in it. I, I couldn't get out. It was focused on a woman, Cordelia. But Rose, she saw me. She knew I was there, that I could hear her. She talked to me. Oh, God. Cordelia. Oh, go. dear. How could I not remember her name? Where are you, Erica? Are you at the Infon Towers? How the hell do you know that? Erica, this is important. Is Jean with you? No, he's not. He snuck over here alone, and now I'm trying to find him. You have to get him out of there, Erica. He is in danger. Then I'm going to need your help. I can't get stuck in another vision. Listen, Cordelia is a scion, too. What you experienced was a magnification of your powers. There are cases documented where two scions with complementary gifts can be connected in such a way. One such as you might see the past, and so the other... Would see the future. Rose, this Shit. is not good. If she can see the future, well, that doesn't exactly put the odds in my favor. Why are you so sure John is in danger? That is not important now. What is important is that he can still be helped. Find John quickly. And don't forget, you are extremely resourceful and strong. Entering a deeper vision can be troubling at first. But as long as you do not forget yourself, you will be able to come out at any time. Okay. Thanks. I won't leave here until John is with me. Thank you, Rose. Take good care of yourself, my dear. The spirits are restless tonight. Oh, God. Okay. Um, let's, uh... Let's go... And stuff. Okay, call button. Uh, 
Uh, I guess this one. Okay, Erica. Time to slow it down for a second. Whose place is this? Good God. Okay. Not until I know more. I'm not okay. here to wake people up or cause a scene. Yet. Yet. Okay. Glass table? The reason I love glass tables? You can always rely on them to have at least one usable fingerprint. Good God. Okay. Let's uh, see what's over here. What? Someone's what? coming. What? This was so stupid. A murderer Shh. led me here. Shite. God damn it! God damn it! Oh god, it's him. Uh, you don't see anything. Hello He's again, Ms. Right Reed. Me. Please stand up. Agent Reed. Where is Cordelia? I see. Well, you've come to the right place. I'm here to inform you that Ms. Smith wants you to make yourself at home here. But of course, you wouldn't have gotten in here if she didn't want it. Wait, who are you? You're not just a property manager. How are you involved with Cordelia? I am the Smith family lawyer. My name is Scorobius. And Cordelia? Do you know where she is? <clears throat> no, but she made mention of a... John, I believe, before she left. Yes, definitely John. She said that you'd likely be wanting this. And also that, as I've stated, you have free access to her home. Nothing withheld. So this place... Wait, 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 wait. Is Cordelia's? All 33 floors. Wait. Damn it. What did he drop off? He said it was from Cordelia. Oh, God damn it. Miss Smith, I wanted to tell you in person, but you are out, so I'm leaving you this note. I've looked into your brother's situation as much as I was able to. There is definitely some bad blood between him and people in other companies he stepped on to get where he is. That said, I can't make this investigation any further. It's out of my hands. Sorry. Huh. That's cognition, that bitch. Okay. Here we go. Oh, God. Uh, what is she doing to me? What am I supposed to think? You're supposed to think that you can do something for me. Maybe you need to talk to someone. Rose can help. And watching the pats get ripped apart is no help. Double your bet. Okay. Okay. This feels the same as that vision on the balcony. But okay. I've got a little more control now. I can leave the vision if I want to. It's the Boston office. Hmm. This memory feels years old, before I was an agent. But it's still amazingly clear. A lady at the front desk pointed me back here to Agent John McCoy. Oh, I'm getting that feeling again. Like someone's watching me out of the corner of their eye. Hmm. Huh. John, Cordelia came to you? You've met her? Ugh, no. Oh, God. Erica can leave her current uh, vision by pressing the smaller circle inside the cognition sphere. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. I'm clicking. Here we go. Uh, this. There's a big stack of folders it. here, each named with different. Hey, wait! Max's name is on this one! Okay. It has Max's name and that was a case number. There we go. I just saw it. Okay, cool. I think that's all I have to get from that. Uh, John? I'm looking for John McCoy. Is that you? The one and only. What's this about? I was led to believe. <laughs> oh, okay. Damn it. I don't know what she was trying to get help for. It must have been something pretty serious, though. 
I won't get a clear vision of what they talked about until I know why she was approaching John. But there is one fragment here I think I can feel out. It's about... Rose? Okay. This all right, one. all right, all right. I'm sorry. This whole week has been lousy, and watching the paths get ripped apart is no help. But what am I supposed to think? You're supposed to think that you can do something for me. Maybe you need to talk to someone. Here, there's this woman, Rose. She runs an antique shop, and she's gifted. She knows about visions and things. She's been giving me some guidance. Give her a call. There's a desk down in the end you can sit at to call. Cordelia can use her precognition gifts to get help. The notebook icon on the upper left is where she writes down obstacles or uncertainties. Okay. And the notebook press on the pencil icon lets her enter a precognition cognitive state and write whatever comes to her. Okay. So is this my hint now? I got a card for this woman named Rose. Phone call. Okay. Am I allowed to go and... I can't exit, so... Yes, beyond your control. Help must come from outside yourself. Okay, how do I go see Rose then? Um, I bet he's one of those types who's really messy but still solves every case. Okay. I need to know why she'd show up to the bureau asking for help. Okay. I guess I have to get out for now. Don't do this, please. Weird. The Cordelia I just saw doesn't seem like the same sociopath who's been toying with me lately. Once Erica has assessed a deeper version she can return to it at any time press the smaller circle beside the cognition okay cool cool I said cool I clicked you should, oh. before I pick that up give me two seconds alright so this is actually a really long break from the last time I recorded because I was running out of battery and I didn't want anything to be corrupted but now I can film for a few more minutes and uh yeah so yeah uh actually i'm supposed to look up here first uh yo e this is terrence hey look at this nifty new software i've got you can browse old case files just like your normal you normally would only now you don't need to be at your workstation have fun with it also you can send me scans of things you want me to look up it's been an uneventful couple of days so I can be your research jockey you complained before about not being able to keep up with sports sports casts I added something else that's that'll let you look up old scoring records in case you get nostalgic for a few days when we still had time to go to ball games together thanks buddy thanks WMF been a while since seeing you uh, okay, so this is the file that we saw in the vision. Special Agent Davies and I took a look around the place. Agent Davies talked to Mr. Smith while I looked around. Evidence logged as that was found on a glass table in the living room. And item blah 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 was found in a trash can. Was taken from the surface of a ch Okay. That's uh, something. Ha. Huh. Music. Text Rose. Let's text her. Uh, in apartment. Let's see this. I saw a file with Max's name on it. Do you have some way to look up? Okay, we already did that. Found D. Uh, Rose, I'm in Cordelia's apartment, and there's a place where I can enter deeper visions. See if there are others in the apartment they surely okay so I'm guessing the glass table is trash can and a thing okay but let's uh I'll look around this vase this vase va has a big chip in it so this place isn't perfect hmm okay so that's the one dining table stairs 
Let me see if I can do it right away. You, you, and go over here to the glass table. Did we? There we go. So here we go. Yes, that's it. Wait, McAdams and Davies were here? What is going on? Oh god, okay. Let's look at them. Davies. Didn't think I'd see you again. Huh. Davies. Okay, that's it. That's all? Let's see, touch him. Hmm. There are FBI agents here. Would you please get your brother for us? Papers on the table. I'll be up momentarily. What are you doing? Max, I was upstairs being... What? The hell's going on? Would you please get your brother for us? Miss? FBI? Yes, and we need to talk to your brother. Okay, but I need your help. I don't know what she's asking about. The vision starts to fall apart. If I knew more. Oh, good God. That's it? That's it? Is that all I... Okay. Door. Oh, God. Am I allowed in the rooms? Shit, shit, shit. Fancy oh. office. She's going to work from home. This is the way to do it. Good God. E envelope. Envelope. It's Touch empty. It. There's something odd about it. Like it was left here deliberately. Can... Is it because you want me to touch it? I'm touching it? There we go. Hmm. This is something. I need him to sign away his claim on the town. You do your thing, I'll do mine. I've spent the past two days getting nowhere on this one design. Keith. That's it. What? That must be Max, Cordelia's older brother. She mentioned him in the cemetery. So this vision must be from at least six years back. I still can't believe I took that rose from Max's grave. Though I wonder now if Cordelia knew that was going to happen. Hmm. <clears throat> okay. Things I can touch. Okay. Uh, well, let's talk to Max first because he's right in front of us. Hey, did the mail come yet? Did we get. Yes, it came. And everything is as bad as it could be. How are we going to get the Enthon Towers functioning as a sustainable and profitable housing venture if politicians and nitwits won't get their fangs out of our asses? I can okay. go and talk to some people downtown, maybe try something a little more tactful than whatever you've been doing to upset them like this. What's their issue now? Eleventh hour building code shit. They can smell blood. They know we're doing something good. They don't want anyone to raise the bar because they know it'll mean they'll have to start jumping higher. And? Huh. That's it? Just a few more building code hurdles? <sighs> And there's a thing with Keith. I need him to sign away his claim on the towers. You can imagine how willing he is to do that. This place is his baby. We had a fight. Oh, God. Huh. <sighs> so, what is it you need from Keith exactly? Look, the bureaucrats are descending. They'll do everything they can to slow us and stop us. I need Keith to give up his claim on his involvement in the towers, but he refuses to sign these. Of course he does. What did you think? He'd bow out of the way? He designed this place, Max. He wants acknowledgement. Well, he's not hmm. gonna get it. They're trying to rezone this area before everything's even done. Stop. We moved that. too fast on this, Cordelia. We, we were so eager to go, 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 that we didn't slow down to consider that people are, well, people. Max, you're not that cynical. Look, it's the High Rollers lounge we're trying to get into, and they don't like that we're using the express elevator. There's pride at stake. Sorry, guys. My 
little goddaughter went through the door and the ladder almost fell. Stuff like that. I'm sorry if you heard me, like, whisper, get out. I didn't mean you. Seriously. Give me the papers. I'll get Keith to sign. Cordelia, he won't. Max, you're a businessman, not a diplomat. You do your thing, I'll do mine. Hmm. No way! That's a safe back and there? That's how we win it. <laughs> Together. You have a safe in here? I didn't know that. Was that Keith's idea too? No, mine. Guilty. Always wanted to be in a gangster film, yeah, Shay? <laughs> Oh, it'll be a great little surprise I can impress clients with. Seriously, who has one of these anymore? Max, if you show it off, you're defeating the purpose. <laughs> True. Anxious. Max, what's up? You've been wound very tight lately. Maybe it's the caffeine. I have been throwing it back lately. That's not good. <sighs> well, I hate to drive past your defenses, but I did notice the old family photo was out on your desk. You didn't dig that out for nothing. Have you been missing mom and dad? Miss dad? No. I got it out so I could look at it and remind myself he wasn't a monster. Or a giant. He was just a man. A really good businessman who never stepped out of that one role. And I'm hmm. afraid I'm turning into him. I do the same. I put up a facade to deal with meetings and investors. God knows I'm good at it. Look at all we've got. <sighs> but lately, I'm afraid I'm just becoming the facade. Don't say that. I encourage him. You're the sister. Max, you might be a natural at what you do, but you're too good-hearted to lose yourself to a role that you play well. It doesn't feel that way, though. Look. Even though mom and dad are dead, it still feels like they're looking Wait, they're on both dead? and making sure I take care of you and Keith. And when I slip up and stop playing my role, it feels like dad is in the next room, holding the belt. No way, Max. He may have been strict, but he wanted us to be happy above all else. <sighs> That's easy for you to say. Dad made it clear that he liked you. He always forced me to earn it, and he made it clear that he was teaching me to look after the family. <sighs> I don't know. Maybe I'm just trying to fill the shoes of a ghost. Well, I'm that. glad you brought it up. We'll work on this, okay? That's it? Okay. Let's uh, look around again. Hmm. Photograph. It's an old photo of the family. It's one of the few we have. Mom and Dad weren't really picture people. Who's that other dude? Phone. Hmm. Console button. I've never been able to get this thing to work. No one to call. Hmm. I could call the front office, but no, I don't need to bug Nate. Hmm. Chair carvings. Fireplace. Some nights when I can't sleep, I'll come in here, start up a little fire, and curl up on the couch with a book. Hmm. That's nice. Max desk. A chair, painting, coat rack. Painting. You're not supposed to touch. It's bad for the pigment. So, his painting hides a safe. Hmm. No wonder he was so particular about it. Uh, is that... Okay. Oh, this. What's the first step to getting papers signed? Ask Keith. Can I actually exit? Oh, I can. I'm getting that feeling again. It's been happening a lot lately. It feels kind of like a quick headache. <laughs> But it's more than that. What's strange What's is I feel as though I could almost choose to make it happen. As as if I could What's happening to me? Oh god. Whoa. She was having visions. Probably her first guessing from the reaction she had. 
Good God. Black flower. Oh God. This must have been the flower king. Yep, there's the cut step. Where was that coming from? It felt like it came from inside my head. And whose voice was that? It almost sounded familiar. <sighs> Get a grip. Okay. Good fucking god. Is that all that I got? God damn. There's a black flower here now, though. Mom loved this species. I always try to keep at least one around in memory of her. Their smell has a wonderfully comforting effect on me. Hmm. When I'm stressed, I try to keep one near me. I see. Let's go over here. And more. And more. What about up here? The stairs. I literally don't know exactly what I'm doing right now, so, um... Oh, here's Keith. Hey, Keith! What's up? Hey, Keith, what are you working on? You kidding? Nothing. I've spent the past two days getting nowhere on this one design problem, and maybe it'll turn out the whole idea's crap. And then, I have Max showing up, pestering me to sign away all claims on the towers. Didn't this same sort of thing happen when Max tried to solicit your design ideas for the towers in the first place? You said it couldn't be done, you were too wrapped up in the thing before it boo-hoo-hoo -hoo rocks and hard places. Well, no, but... Thanks. I see what you're doing, and, and you're right. But this latest thing I'm trying to do, it just hurts to keep thinking about, but I can't let it go. I can at least think about the tower's design and feel good. It's one big problem that I solved. Hmm. So you're on to the next thing? The gears don't stop spinning in that head of yours, do they? You make it nope. sound like a choice, Cordy. I'm working on the Ori over there. I'm trying to make it into a functional tool for measuring planetary movements. Orrery? That's what that thing with the planets is called? Well, huh. ours is a little different, but yes. I just need to work on balancing it and I'll be finished. But it's tricky. I need to use the right wrench on the right planet and I have to adjust it in the right direction. Adjust it? I'm using these to make the fine adjustments, but nothing has worked so far. Allie, Al, Al, whatever. Allen keys, there, I got it. Uh... Can you tell me what progress you've made with the orrery? Not much to say. I haven't been very systematic, so I don't know. Maybe I'm losing my edge. Keith, don't talk like that. You're just down. Lots of stress lately. Hmm. It's true. Just go fix Keith, it then. I have a suggestion for how you could fix those planets you're working on. Yeah? What's that? Uh, medium? Use the medium wrench. I don't know. Can I exit out of it? Adjust the red planet with it. I don't know. And turn it clockwise. No, Cordelia. I'm sure I already tried that and it... God damn. Okay, goodbye. I'll talk to you later. All right. Let me see here. So this is Keith. Cordelia's hmm. other brother, I guess. Huh. Maybe I can look him up. Maybe even call him. Hmm. Keith needs help with the planets. How can I help? Your gifts are your ally. Good God. Okay, model. Let's see so, here. So that's something that Keith is going to do sometime in the future. I've had this feeling before, but never focused on it like this. Am I allowed to? Models of planets. Can I actually please look at it? I can't get it. I can tell there's something to see, but... I'm not very good at this. Oh, I don't think I'll be able to see it. 
God damn it. I can't figure out this Ori thing. Green. That that's it? That's all? That's it? That's all you're gonna Ah, oh, you're so helpful. You're so helpful. Small helix. Where is it? Looks like Keith's soldering some sort of rocket ship. Fun. Hmm. Wow. Hey, that's me. Painting of Janelle and Mallory. Oh, never mind. Sweet girls. Twins with congenital heart problems. This painting was part of a fundraiser Max set up for them. That's sweet. Um... God damn it. Uh, how am I supposed to help you? Why the hell not? What what's happening? I don't know what I'm doing. I should What about this? It's been a long day, and if I go in there I'll probably end up going right to bed. Oh, so that's your room. Okay. You know what? Uh I think I'll get out. Here we go. Oh, okay. Cool. I can look up their files. Okay. Max Smith. Maxwell Smith was a third generation entrepreneur based in Boston, Massachusetts. Is that right? I'm sorry if I don't know my shit. He primarily worked alongside his sister Cordelia Smith developing luxury livings spaces in the Boston area though an electric electric assortment of patents and design prototypes came out of the company as well Max Smith is deceased survived survived by Cordelia Smith and Keith Smith his death occurred in October of 2005. Exact date and, date and time are unknown. Cause of death? Unconfirmed, though fire is the most likely cause. ID could only be made by matching dental records. Okay. And Keith Smith. Who is he? Occupant unknown. He is, young, he is younger brother to Maxwell Smith. So I guess Keith is the youngest? I don't know. Boston-based entrepreneur, while his exact occupants, occupation is unknown, it is presumed his he works within the family business. As of 2006, his whereabouts are unknown. Blimey sake. Ha. Huh. Let's see here. Can I touch it? Huh? This hides the Smith family safe. Okay, so touch it. And behind painting number two, we have... Yep, Max is safe. Just like I saw in the vision. Hmm. Can you touch it? Oh, God. Oh, no. I would... I won't know any of these. Okay. Won't touch it for now. You are excused. Um... Let's see this phone. So, what? She left it here because she knew I could use my powers on it? Probably. How about here? You shouldn't be up, because you were up in the... That won't work there. What could I possibly use? This? This on this? Those two don't work together. Touch it? Oh god, what did I do? It lit up, but just for a second. Didn't seem to do anything. I have my own phone. I, I got it, okay, fine. Uh, let's exit. Hmm. 
you're still up, so that's something. Uh, Davies and McAdams. Hmm. Is that why you had a conflict with the lawyer? Because McAdams knows him. Okay, let's go upstairs. Blimey sick. Huh. Let's see. Is this the extent of... Some kind of Batman memorabilia? Ow. <laughs> nice. Is there anything... Oh, here. I can look at it. And then go back into the vision. And figure out... Let me see if I can find any memories relevant to Keith working on this thing. Let's see here. So the small wrench definitely isn't the one to use, but I still need to lock the green planet in place. Look at that. I have a lot more control if I jiggle the wrench as I turn it. So I just don't know whether it's clockwise or... So it's Green Planet. Small wrench. I don't know, let me see again. Just to make sure. Let me see if I can find any memories relevant to Keith working on this thing. So the small wrench definitely isn't the one to use, but I still need to lock the green planet in place. Look at that. I have a lot more control if I jiggle the wrench as I turn it. I'll try small. Huh. Let's see if I can jump in from here. Is it this one? Here we go. Okay. I think the other one I is I don't know Davis. how I know this. It just hit me. Keith needs to jiggle the hex keys when he makes adjustments with them. Okay. Talk to him. Keith? Keith? I have a suggestion for how you could fix those planets you're working on. Yeah? What's that? Use the small wrench. Mm-hmm. On the green Adjust planet? Adjust the green planet with it. And... I don't know which one. Let's try And turn clockwise. it clockwise, but jiggle it when you do. No, Cordelia. I'm sure I all. Okay, it's the other Keith? one then. Yeah? Small Use wrench? The... Adjust green. the... And, and turn it kept- No, Cordelia. I'm sure I already tried- God damn it. Keith? Okay. Yeah? Okay. Use the me medium. And Adjust I know the it's green the green planet. And it's turn it counterclockwise, clockwise. but jiggle it as you- Is it different? No, Cordelia. I'm sure I all- Mother Keith? of- Yeah? Okay. Use medium. the medium. Adjust- Green. And turn it clockwise. Clock Hmm. Interesting thought. There we go. If I... Wait. Yes, that's it! Are you doing it? You gonna do it? He's pretty gone. It's a good thing. Oh. He is... O okay, I'll, I'll leave you to it. It's, uh... Ha! I helped Keith out. What now? Give him pa- oh. Sorry. I'll go ahead and give him the papers now. Cause I solved it. Some fucking guy. I'm the smarts. Okay. Here you go, buddy. Keith, will you sign these papers for Max? But I just can't get this calculation to match up. It matched up last time. Why doesn't this one- Huh? Oh yeah. Upside down, buddy. What's you this? You definitely did that wrong. This one has a second name on it. Jeff Therian. Who's that? Do I sign it? I don't know. It was with the papers that Max needed you to sign. 
Maybe this Jeff has to sign it also. Don't care, it's signed. If he doesn't need it, too bad. Now let me work. I need to see if I can... if I can just... Good God. Okay. Let's do it. Did you not have cell phones back then? That's what... Oh. You're moving by yourself. Okay. Or, uh... Okay. Ah! Uh, what's going on? Please. Oh god, okay, you keeled over. Um that was like okay. the vision I had down on the balcony, and it makes more sense now. She wasn't just seeing any old visions. She was seeing her brother dying. She lost consciousness there, which stopped the vision. Maybe I can pick up the trail to the rest of that incident someplace else. What? Okay. Uh. Although I think that's enough time for now. I'm pretty sure I'm a little bit over from what I recorded from last time. So, yeah. I'll glub you guys later. Bye.